Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Well, welcome everybody to the Team Freedom Reigns hashtag TFR Motivation Monday Zoom call. We have a pretty special special guest for you today. Uh, my voice is kind of hoarse. I've actually been coughing, so I'm just going to get this intro over. I'm going to mute myself so you can hear from my beautiful wife, Marcy. But welcome, everybody. We've got a great special guest for you and just want to welcome you to this call that happens every Monday at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Put it on your calendar, make it happen, and make this a fixture. So over to you, babe. Awesome. Thanks, babe. And by the way, guys, if you're not able to be on here live with us every single Monday, we know that that is not always possible, but we've got you covered. So you can always go back and listen to the recordings on the Team Freedom Reigns YouTube channel or the Freedom Reigns SoundCloud. So please, please, please go and subscribe on both of those channels as soon as we're done with this call so that you actually get um, notified when we post our new trainings, our new calls, and just some kinds of silly stuff that we do sometimes. But let's go ahead and get through um, these announcements that we do every single week. We're gonna remind you guys of what's going on because it's super important to keep the things that you want into your focus because the things that you focus on the most are the things that you're going to get. I know that many of the people on our team are actually participating in the physique transformation contest that actually just started March 1st and goes through March 31st of this year. There are some phenomenal prizes. I mean, significant prizes. Can you say $5,000 cash for the top woman loser and the top men's loser also gets $5,000 in cash? When I talk about loser, actually you're the big winners because that means that you've lost the most inches the most fat percentages, and you are now transformed by using the physique system. So you can keep, you can enroll and register for this at any time. That registration does not close. You can get people enrolled into our physique product line and help them get started in this contest at any time before the deadline, which is the end of the contest, okay? So congratulations to those of you that are going hard for that. Um, we're cheering you on. Now guys, they will be celebrated at Elite Academy in Kansas City, Missouri in July. There's a lot of celebration that's gonna be going on because it's actually Life Vantage's 10 year anniversary. So it's gonna be a big party the whole time and there will actually be parties going on. So you do not want to miss out on this Elite Academy. Registration right now is $129 through April 30th and then it just goes up from there. So the only thing waiting does is cost you more money. So go and get registered and make sure that as you're enrolling new distributors that you're helping them get pre-registered, especially those gold and platinum pack distributors, they have free tickets in their packages, but they still have to pre-register or they will be charged full price at the door. We do not want that to happen to anybody, right? And Brian Tracy says it best, to earn more, you must learn more. And that's what Elite Academies are all about. And Brian Tracy will actually be our keynote speaker. I am so excited to hear this man in person at this event. It's gonna be just a phenomenal learning experience. So get registered, guys. All right, so who of you are going to be influencers in Kansas? So in February at our last Elite Academy, they started this new program to where you can become an influencer. They figured out exactly what it took for the last year of all the elites that became elite distributors, what it took for them to become distributors. And we're not gonna go over the details on that, but basically it paved the way and it's as easy as one, two, three on how you, if you have the proper behaviors each and every single day, each and every single week, each and every single month for a long enough period of time, you too will be an influencer as an elite ranked distributor. If that's what you want, if you're one of the crazy ones and you're going all out, right? So this is what you need to do, the one, two, three. We wanna help at least one person every single month somewhere in our organization become that pro three pay setter, making that foundational rank a priority. Then we also want to make sure that we're enrolling two new business partners each and every single month. And that just means that we're sharing this information and we are passionate about it and finding other people that want change in their lives. And then the three of the one, two, three is check out three new customers every single month. And that's gonna help you accomplish some pretty cool stuff. So as you can see on the left-hand side, these are the requirements for this promotion. If you do what's on the left, you get what will get what's on the right. So if you're a new distributor through Pro 2, you see what your requirements are. Pro 3s and Pro 4s, and then Pro 5s and above. They do this so that each one of us is challenged because having a challenge helps us to push harder than we would without it. And by the way, if you accomplish this easy as one, two, three to become an influencer, you are going to be 
recognized and celebrated as an elite level distributor in Kansas City with the following rewards. You'll get preferred seating throughout the event, special gift and swag. You'll also get an attendance at the elite reception, which happens the night before the event starts. And it's actually gonna be somewhere pretty fun and cool. It's at the Hall of Fame for men's collegiate basketball. So that's gonna be a pretty cool event to be able to attend. We would love to have so many of you there with us. Plus you'll get recognition during the event. This qualification period goes through June 30th. Don't worry, if you're just getting started on this promotion, it doesn't matter if you missed out on February. It doesn't matter if you haven't enrolled anybody yet in March. You can actually accumulate these and do it all at one time if you want to, or just break it up into the rest of the months that are available for the qualification. All right, another promo. Life Vantage is so good at giving us things to shoot for. So March Madness. All right, we're halfway through this promotion now. And so what we really want to focus on is this is the first time ever that Life Vantage has given us the opportunity to enroll new business partners with a free starter kit. All right, through the end of the month, any distributor that you enroll at the silver, gold, or platinum pack levels, gets a free starter kit. That's a $50 value, guys. We wanna make sure that we're taking advantage of this because guess what? Not only is that free for your new enroller enrollments, but you also, as you're enrolling people, will start to get to points. And these points will transfer into dollars. The more people you enroll, the more extra bonuses that you're gonna have coming into your bank account. So March Madness is a promotion that you definitely wanna shoot for. So we actually have several people that are shooting for the winner's bracket, which has some top prizes. But for the rest of us that aren't in that winner's bracket, guess what? We still have cash prizes waiting for us. So let's get to work. All right, everything that we're sharing with you right now is actually um, all part of a system that LifeVantage has in place. So as you enroll those new distributors, you wanna make sure that they know what the next step in the system is. And that is being aware of how to become a Pro 2 pay setter and a Pro 3 pay setter. What it means is that we want to get them into action quickly. We want them to get checks fast because the sooner we get them paid, the longer they will stay in business with you. So the requirements are at the right-hand side of the screen here. They can actually earn an additional $700 in bonuses. So if you're not quite sure on how to work out the pay setter program, please get with someone that's part of your upline support team and ask. It's all about asking questions when you're building a business because you're never alone in building your life vantage business. We're all here to help and support you. So let's work on this pace at our pro two and pro three system and everything adds up to points for the Ireland incentive trip. So we have several people that are close to um, qualifying for this incentive trip. We have people that have already qualified the way that you make points is by enrolling new distributors and customers, by rank advancing, by holding your new rank, and by helping your personal enrollments rank advance as well, and as they hold it for the next month, you'll also get additional points. So if you're close, make sure you know what you need. If you have a question about it, make sure you get with someone that can help walk you through it um, and so that you can make sure that you're in Ireland in August. New markets are opening up. There's so much craziness going on right now with LifeVantage, with our growth in products and in markets. We just opened Spain, and the rest of those countries will be open by the end of fiscal year, which is June 2019. So super excited for us to be open in these additional markets of France, Greece, Belgium, and Ireland by the end of June. All right, guys, so now finally, finally, I get to stop talking. I get to bring on the key to tonight's topic. And this is going to be Susan Lil. She goes by Susie. And I'm super, super excited for her to share with you guys tonight all about turning your excuses on why you can't build your life vantage business into the reasons why you must be building it. So I am actually going to share with you um, an introduction that was given to me by her personal enroller, Marjorie Ham. Um, she knows Susie better than any of us because they work very closely together and they're, they're cheerleaders for each other. But this is what Marjorie said. She said that she'd love to introduce Susie to all of us here at Team Freedom Rings. She said that Susie is from the tip of Texas, 10 miles from the border of Mexico in a city called Far. It's very far, far, far away from everybody else, is what Marjorie said. Um, Susie is a retired school counselor and former home economics teacher. She is a single parent of two grown children. Jonathan is 29 
and working on his PhD at Stanford University in California. Alyssa is 18 and is currently at Strong Tower Ministry Program in Houston, Texas. Susie is currently the caregiver for her elderly parents who are very dependent on her. She is also a Christian and believes in serving God by serving others. This is one of many of the reasons she joined as a, a distributor with LifeVantage in that it allows her to bless other people as she continues to educate her family and friends. Currently, Susie is ranked at Pro 2, but is declaring advancement with God's blessings. Her favorite scripture is Philippians 4.13. We can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. So guys, I would like for each and every one of you to help me welcome Miss Susie Lil to this call. I'm gonna go ahead and stop sharing so that we can see Susie. Um, Susie, can you hear me okay? I can, can you hear me? I can, yay! Awesome, awesome. So I am so, so excited. Um, let me go ahead, I want to go to just the speaker view here. Okay, very cool. All right, so Susie, I'm gonna ask you some questions because I know that you're nervous, right, about being on this call with us. Um, and yet, when I asked you, you said yes right away. Um, I am so excited um, for you to step outside your comfort zone, and yet what you did is you brought support system with you, right? Or you went to your support system. So you're actually with Marjorie at her home, and she's right next to you, which is really exciting. Um, but Susie, would you please share with us more about who you are um, and, you know, why, why are you here with us with LifeVantage? Can you share your story with us? Yes. Um, good evening, everybody. I, like, I, like I was introduced, I am a retired school counselor, was a, a teacher before becoming a counselor, worked in that profession as an educator for 30 years. Um, I am also a mother, mother of two, very proud, and a caregiver for my parents. I'm a prayer partner at my church, and I am now considered a professional biohacker. <laughs> um, the reason why I came into Life Vantage was because there was, I was having severe health issues. And it wasn't only me that was having health issues. There are several people in my family that were struggling. Within the past five years, uh, I had to retire to be able to take care of my daughter, who was, ha she had to be taken out of school. She struggles with uh, bipolar, PTSD. Um, she had been hospitalized for more than 23 times. So I was dealing with my daughter. Then my, my dad, within the past five years, has had three major surgeries. My mother has had three major surgeries. My older sister came down with cancer. And so there was a lot of health issues in my family. And I, I struggled myself with health issues because of all the stress that I was going through. Uh, I was actually waking up in my sleep vomiting because of the stress. And I was going through so much, having to deal with everything on my plate. Uh, I had a couple of surgeries. One surgery went bad. The doctor actually hit the main nerve to my stomach and left my stomach partially paralyzed. So I couldn't eat and I was very weak. My hair was falling out. You could see in my skin that I looked sick. I was very pale. Uh, I didn't have the energy to take care of everybody and I didn't have energy to take care of myself. At one point, I really thought I was going to die. I was that sick. Um, I went to get my hair done because I thought it would cheer me up. And I went to my cousin's uh, studio where she's a hairdresser. And I, I noticed that she had so much energy and I asked her, what is it? What are you doing? How do you have so much energy? How can you keep up with everything that you, that you have on your plate? And that's when she told me, oh, it's, it's these, these vitamins that I take. I said, what? She, I said, where can I get some? And she tells me, no, you can only buy it through a distributor. And I don't know how to explain it all, so I'm going to connect you to the person who sold it to me. So that's how I made my connection to Marjorie. And Marjorie right away came over and started explaining everything. And, and she said, this is really good for you. It's going to help you. And it will also be a financial opportunity to help you get out of the situation you're in. Uh, backtracking, when I started going, thinking about my career, uh, 
a lot of the things that I did as an educator, I loved. I loved working with people. I loved helping people, especially as a counselor. I got to work with parents, with students, especially students that had special needs. And I felt fulfilled in doing that. So when I retired, I felt like I lost a part of me. I didn't get, to, I didn't get that feeling of helping people anymore. And I miss that. I miss being able to contribute and, and blessing people. I did get some of that back when I was in church because I was able to pray for people, but yet I didn't have it as a, an occupation. I didn't have, that part of me was, was gone. And I felt like it was taken from me be, before I should have had to quit. But uh, when I found out about the opportunities with Life Vantage, I thought, wait a minute, you know, here's a chance for me to give back. Here's a chance for me to help people and to even help them with their health issues because it really made a difference in my health. It didn't take long after taking the products that I started getting my energy back. I started feeling better. I started getting my weight back. My hair started coming back. And now that we have this new shampoo, it's just like, wow. I was just thrilled with the product. So the product actually sold me. And that's what convinced me, you know what? We've got something golden here. It's a gift to give to others. Mm -hmm. And being able to bless others by sharing it with them was something that gave me pleasure. And I missed having that. So that's a little bit about how I came into Life Vantage. I was really eager to, to work with a team. And I, I was very blessed by having Marjorie as my mentor and all the other people in our team down here, I started, you know, going full, full force right away. But then I came into other life situations that got in the way. My sister, my sister came down with cancer. My parents got really sick. And, and it was hard to keep up with actually having presentations, meeting with, with uh, different people. It, it put... Uh, a hinder on things. It kind of slowed things down. In fact, I started losing some of my distributors. I started losing some of my customers, but I didn't want to get discouraged. And what kept me encouraged about moving forward was I knew that I needed to stay plugged in. I knew that. I knew that if I didn't continue with going to the LVAs, if I didn't go to Global or to Elite Academy, my fire was going to die. I wanted to be rekindled. I wanted to have that fire going. Even though I didn't see the success as much as I wanted it to, and I'm still trying, I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up because I'm not a quitter. I don't want to stop. Uh, I love being around the team that we have. The products are amazing. You know, I can see that the, the benefits. When you're, when you're around all these people that have had success, you want that to rub off on you. You want to be able to give that to others. Mm -hmm. And so it becomes contagious, like a biohacker fire. That's how I see it. <laughs> I love that. I love everything that you've shared so far. I mean, because you've shared so much of your heart already, the experiences that you had being a teacher and, and loving educating people and understanding that what we do is an education of people, right? We're not trying to sell anyone. We're just providing them with good information that we're super passionate about and giving them the opportunity to learn. So I love that you, you pinpointed that so beautifully and that you hit on the struggles that you have going on in your personal life with health issues all the way around you. You know, you had your own, but now with your parents and with your daughter, and I understand that, you know, going to Charleston, you had some tough decisions to make and it was very difficult for you. Can you share a little bit about your feelings, you know, making the decision to go and then actually going to Charleston? Um, in February, my mother became very sick and she had to have, uh, she's in hospice right now. She had to have a feeding tube put in. But before the feeding tube, she was just really sick. We thought we were gonna that she was gonna pass, and it was it was a, a struggle because that was also around my birthday, and I had already had plans, you know, that I wanted to go, I wanted to 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 grow, I wanted to be around my LV family, and and I wanted to stay home with my family, and it was just a really hard decision, and I I prayed about it. I prayed before I left, 
you know, of wanting to ask if this was the right choice in, in leaving. I did the best that I could with always taking care of both of my parents. You know, I've given, you know, out from my heart in, in providing for their needs. I prayed for her and I, I asked myself, what would my mom want for me? What would she want for me to do? And I decided that I needed to go. I needed to go so that I could continue to grow because I had to go back to my why. What, what was the reason why I, I joined Life Vantage to begin with? It was to bless people. It was to bless my family. It was to leave a legacy for my children. It was to earn that extra little money so that I could eventually be able to take trips to go visit my son in California or to go spend more time with my daughter. So I went back to my why. And that was the reason why I decided to leave. And I was blessed. I was blessed by going. I was around, you know, everybody that energized me again. I came back and I said, my mom was still with us. She's still here with us. Today, she was hospitalized again. And, you know, it's just heartbreaking because I want to be there for her. I, and I, and I want to continue growing. But I also have to think about, you know, how many other people are de being dependent? So many people that I haven't met yet that are going to be influenced by coming into this company, by taking the products. And I, I have to think overall, how many other people can I bless? How many other people need to hear this story and need to, to be encouraged? And the only way that I'm going to be able to do that is by being a strong leader and showing that to customers by having that fire within me vibrate so that they can see that this is important. This is uh, something that I'm passionate about, something that I feel confident that will help them. And, and maybe it's, it's an answered prayer, just like my prayers were answered when I met Marjorie and I started taking the products. I know that I can do that for somebody else as I've done for my parents. Mm. So yes, it was, it was challenging. You know, that is such a powerful, powerful story for people to hear because there are so many times that we get caught up in a situation that's right in front of our faces, right? Something that we're right in the middle of right now that is difficult, that is painful, that is challenging, that takes all of our emotional focus and our physical power, right? And to be able to um, and I, and I even hate using this word with what you've been going through, you know, being able to use the situation as the excuse as to why someone doesn't go to an event or the reason why you do. It's such a big, I mean, if you can just kind of change your mindset around the difficulties that are going on in your life around you and understanding that those difficulties, like many people will use their children as excuses on why they can't build this business or why they can't spend the extra time making phone calls. Where if we just change our mindset a little bit, that we need to have them be the reason why we are building this business. Um, because the, for one thing, um, I can only imagine how emotionally depleted you were before Charleston, because I get that feeling too in between events. And when it's time for us to have events, I need to go and get refueled. Right. And so when you go and get yourself refueled at these events, when you come back, you're actually a better person, a better provider, a better caretaker. And, and just all the way around better for the people around you. Would you agree? Yes, I agree. It, it, it gets you motivated. And it's, you know, being a caregiver, you have to care for yourself first before you can give to somebody else. If you don't care for yourself, if you don't take care of yourself physically, mentally, spiritually, emotionally, you're no, you're no use to somebody else. So that was my time to get refilled and to be around other people, positive people, energized people, and to come back, you know, to be able to give to my family, to be mm -hmm. more relaxed, to be, be calm and, and just at peace. Yes, most definitely. Most definitely. Oh my goodness. I appreciate you so much. Um, so tell me, how do you truly stay um, committed and determined and passionate 
about building your life vantage business, even with all of this other stuff that's going on in your life. I stay connected to the team. Okay. This is not, I'm not doing it by myself. I stay connected to my team, to, to the people that keep me energized. You know, I make sure that I go to events and if I can't go to events, I'm listening to trainings. Um, you know, I'm just trying to keep, um, abreast about all the changes that are going on. But I think that the main thing is, you know, it's working as a team. It's not, it's not solo. I don't feel like, like I've, I've, I've tried to do other kinds of network marketing and it failed right away because I didn't have that teamwork. I didn't have anybody really teaching me the ups and downs. And we definitely didn't have people that were successful uh, like, like you all are teaching us sharing with us and we appreciate that we appreciate you so much because we learn from each other and we we take you know we learn from the mistakes and we learn from the successes and so that's what keeps me going is just being connected you know some i think it was our pastor that recently said show me your five or tell me your five friends and you look at your friends and that's you know going to tell you what kind of person you are you know, by their character and what things that they do, you end up eventually becoming like them. And so I, I went back and I thought, you know, who are my friends? Who are the people that I'm with that are making an influence on my life? Mm. And, and I really appreciate it, you know, the, my life vantage family, because they have really made an influence in helping me. There were times that, yes, with everything I had on my plate, I got depressed. I was unhappy. I was like feeling down because there was so much stress, so many people sick that were around me. But it was the my friends, my support from my church, my my family members that actually loved me, my children that picked me up and helped me through. And so that's how I think I stay energized is and I give all the credit to God. Okay. I'm not ashamed to say that I need him. And I am not anything without him. And so he is my main source of energy that inspires me. Reading the Bible and just learning from that and applying what I'm learning from what I'm reading and placing it into action. Yes. Amen. 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 So I know that you had kind of a stretch there um, to where you had been sharing the information over and over and over and just weren't having very much success and you were getting frustrated. And yet what just happened? What just happened this last yes, week? Share with us. I was, I was very frustrated because I would invite you know, like 30, 50 people to come to my meetings, you know, and, and tell them, just come out and support me. Come. And I had this one, this one friend of mine that for months, I'm not kidding, for months, I had been asking her, can you please come? Can you please come? And she saw me one time at, at Costco and she, she says, I see you on Facebook and I see that you travel a lot. What is it that you're doing that, you know, I'm very interested in finding that. I said, well, you need to come to one of my meetings. I didn't want to spill the beans and share everything with her. I said, but it'll help you and you'll see where my energy is coming from. And so she finally showed up. She finally showed up Saturday and I was so excited. And I was kind of, I was depressed because I didn't get to go to, the LVA Academy in, in Austin with, with, with the team. I really wanted to go, but because of my parents, I, I stayed home. And we already made a commitment that every Saturday we're going to have a presentation. And so Marjorie wasn't going to be here. And I was here. And so this was the first time that I had to take charge and take over and do the, the meeting from beginning to closure. And... <laughs> It was successful because I actually had guests that showed up. And my friend, the one I had been inviting, I had been persistent. I told her, I'm not giving up on you. One of these days, you're going to come to my meeting. And she did, and she was impressed. And she says, okay, I'm ready. I said, oh, you want to order products? Which one do you want to order? No, she says, I want the gold packet. And I'm like, okay, great. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> so I was really excited that she finally showed up. And she signed up. 
and I had a success and it was my first time. The other challenge that I had was I'm not computer savvy. I am not. And I had to set up the TV, the computer and everything by myself. And I did it. And I was so proud of myself for doing that. I said, wow, you know, I can learn some things still. <laughs> I was really happy about that. Oh my goodness. We are so, so thankful and, and congratulations on your new business partner. We're so excited for you and for all of the Texas team because you're just all blessing so many people. So, so, so many people. So we're about out of time here. So can you please give us one tip that you would share with others who may be running into difficult times in their life and situations and they have that choice to make. Do I use it as an excuse or do I turn it into the reason? Do you have one tip that you could share with them? Pick up the phone. Pick up the phone and call one of your team members so that you can share and you can you can you know just discuss what's going on so that you can uh, branch onto each other and lift each other up and pray that would be my my biggest tip is pray for your team pray for your distributors pray for your customers and for the new members that have not come on board yet so that they can have a receptive heart and be ready to receive with an open mind that would be my tip, is not to forget to, to pray and to reach out to somebody else for help so that you don't feel like you're in it all by yourself. And get out of the boat. Don't stay in the boat. Walk on the water. And, and, and if you sink, you sink, you learn how to swim. <laughs> Exactly. Just like you did on Saturday, having to set everything up, do the whole presentation and look at the reward. Look at the reward in your new business partner. So Susie, thank you so, so very much for being our special guest on well, this podcast. Oh, you are so, so welcome. We are so thankful that you took the time to do that. And just quickly before we, um, I let Don D close it out. Remember, tomorrow night we have the live opportunity overview. I'll be presenting the full version. Um, so invite, invite, invite. But do keep in mind, it's always best to share the Zoom link with your guests because Facebook does not always cooperate. And so we want to make sure that they get in front of the information, okay? So Zoom link is best for guests. But super excited to share. So be inviting, inviting, inviting for tomorrow night. All right, Don D, do you want to go ahead and come on here and close us out, please? Absolutely. Thank you, Susie, so much for your obedience and for your tenacity and never forgetting the proper priority of things and more importantly for your persistence. Thank you for that. And, and just being a, a prayerful warrior in this and, and the, the, the benefit comes when it, when it comes. We don't understand God's plan sometimes, but thank you for, for keeping on the right track. And thank you, Marjorie. I see you off on the side. So I, I know you're trying to hide, but thank you. We see your presence. We feel your presence. Thank you so much for the leadership that you've done, that you've poured into Susie. And Susie, thank you for the leader that you are becoming. It's more and more every day. We see it. It's palpable. We hear about it all the time and just want to celebrate your success. Congratulations. Thank you so much for everything that you do. And thank you for being the best part of our team. Yes. Awesome. All right, everybody. We appreciate you. Thank you, Marjorie. Have a blessed night, everybody. This is the closure of another hashtag TFR Motivation Monday call. We'll see y'all next week. Bye-bye. God bless. Bye. Bye.